Hello everyone, and welcome to Day 7, the finale of 7 Inks, 7 Days. Before we get to our ink, which I already have told you in the title, we will look at our ink from yesterday. Robert Osser's Pen Addict Fire on Fire, and the splats are really fun because... You can see here there's a really sort of like dark orangey and you can sort of see oh i don't know if the light's going to cooperate there's sort of like a halo going on here um let's look at this one real quick this is a ridge blast are really fun but yeah uh Really fun, really fun ink. Um, let's get on to today's ink. The finale. All right. Without further ado, I introduce you to... Hiroshi Zuku Sio Ro. Uh... I said in my first video that Konpeki was my favorite ink, but I think it's a tie between Konpeki and this color, Co Ro. Um, I love this color. I keep it here uh, in its permanent home, this white Twisby Eco with a fine nib. I had a joke in my introduction video, which it was originally very heavily scripted. Uh, about how you shouldn't have favorite children, but this is my favorite pen. Uh, and then one day I would get a Twisby with a medium nib, and then that would be my favorite child. It was a very stupid joke, and I'm regretting telling it to you now. There was a reason why I ended up not using that script. Um, but I love this color. I don't, if you've never used it, it's gonna go on. It goes on the page like a, a very like a teal color, but it it's still sort of it as it fades. It goes to like uh, a it's like a pine green that's you can still see as a as a bluish green, but it's definitely I don't think I would consider it a teal. I think some people might, but I don't. And on like in heavy applications or on the right paper you get a really amazing, like, red halo effect. Like, it is, uh, like, well, one, it's the, almost the perfect Christmas ink, uh, but I use it always. Um, when I don't have it in a pen, I'm a little bit sad because I like to do sort of a journal every day with a different pen. And when I don't, get CO row in that rotation. Uh, it just makes me sad. So, uh, yes, Twisby Nico Eco. Uh, this is a fine nib. I'm not really a fan of the fine nibs in most pens, but I do love this one. Um, seven inks. Seven. Let's just zoom in. Days. Our ink is Hiroshi Zuku Sio Ro. If you've never used a, a Twisby pen before, which is, I mean, I, 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 it would be strange if you haven't. Um, the fine nibs are incredibly smooth. Uh, I'm not really a fan of fine nibs, but this pen is really good. Uh, I've mentioned my uh, pen friend who sort of got me into this, and I also suggested she get a fine nib, and she loves it. Uh, ink. The pen is... Twisby Eco. With a fine nib. And because... It is the finale. I will attempt cursive writing. This is probably a mistake, but I'll do it. The
quick. Brown. Fox. Jumps. Over. And there's the problem with cursive. The... Lazy dog. All right, all right. Lazy dog. Uh, I don't. And not really so much on rhodia paper, but on Midori paper and Tomoe River. Uh, even this fine nib, you will see like the lovely uh, red sheen I was talking about. It was more of a halo. More of a halo, I guess. Not really much of a sheen. Um, but, like, this, this is such, like, a, just a comforting color to me. Uh, and especially, like, today, I wanted to say, like, this video is, going, is a little bit difficult for me to make because I am a Floridian, and yesterday was a very bad day for America. And if any of you, uh, if any of... My, you know, you are watching this. Who live who live in the Washington D.C. area? I really hope you're safe. Um, yeah, just yeah. Um, I hope. I debated about making this video, but I hope that it serves as a nice little distraction until we get back tomorrow to the real work. Or rather, as soon as possible. We gotta get, uh... Oh boy. I'm just gonna stop now. But, anyways. So, see a row. Uh, also, because it is the final day, I am bringing back my little, uh... My paintbrush. Let's do a real large swab this time. Um, because it's the finale. Go big or go home. Oh. All right. So I don't know if you're seeing this, but it definitely goes on like very, very blue. It goes on the page like a like a really nice teal color. Um, I think they have, I think Hiroshi Zuku makes a teal, um, which maybe I should look into getting because I love the Hiroshi Zuku inks. I'm just going to continue to paint. What's Bob Ross today, folks? I don't know. I know definitely I'm gonna get more Roshi Zuku inks. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to resist just the allure of having these beautiful bottles. Um, but I don't know which one is next. Does everyone have like a favorite Roshi Zuku? Like, you start an Roshi Zuku you couldn't live without? Let me know in the comments. We're going to wash this dry a little bit. I even love the, like, I saw, I said in my Takesumi uh, video, like, I was surprised, like, I, I wanted the black because I, I wanted a black ink. Um, but even, like, the black, uh, the color, like, surprised me, like, the depth and everything. So, like, I just... I imagine, like, even the colors that I don't think I would normally gravitate to uh, in the Hiroshi Zuku line, I would probably really dig. But, if anyone has favorites, that would help me know where to start. So let's see, I don't know if you're already seeing this, but, yeah, it's already, uh, like, on my camera it still looks very blue, but, like, in real life, like, like with my eyes... It's already um, uh, drying much, much greener. 
Uh, let's see if I can get the light to cooperate. I think with a little bit more natural light, maybe you can see it. It's still looking way, way more blue on my um, on the camera. But I don't know if you can see it already, but there is definitely that red halo I was talking about already sort of it's going to be all over this page um hard to show up like in normal writing on rhodia paper but yeah if you put enough if you put enough paint on that sucker uh it's going to do all sorts of fun stuff all right let's do this page this journal I'd also like uh, you know I'm, I'm intending on doing more videos um, but I would like to know if anyone has thoughts like what papers would you like to see what uh, what inks would you like to see you know that sort of thing but definitely like what papers uh, like I, I, I intend if I'm gonna do more in-depth videos that uh, I definitely want to get a broader range of paper seven inks seven days man this pen is just such a delight to use today is a day to use your most delightful pen folks seven inks seven days I believe I reverse the order and list of the pen first. Pisby Eco with a fine nib. I got a comment uh, saying that the, the the volume was pretty low. Um, and I use these sort of Apple headphones with just an Apple phone to record. So hopefully the the audio is better. I, I have a tendency just to speak very quietly. Um, and I will try and get better about that, and I will also try and buy an actual microphone. That might have to wait for a bit, though. Let's see, Ink, Hiroshi, Zuku, Seo, Ro. I have to check. Do I normally do this thing? Ah, this is what I do. Whew, my brain all over the place. Today is a day. I wait for January 20th with bated breath. Ba -ba 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 -ba. that for now all right oh man i don't even think i mentioned i bought this ink because uh i was looking for a second ink the compacti was my first ink that i bought and then i was like well i have to buy a second ink uh, and that's when i bought i bought the pen addict fire on fire which by the way if you want that ink uh, you can only get it from uh the pen addict uh he has a store and I believe he's the only one that sells that. And then I was trying to get a second ink. Uh, and uh, I was like, okay, well, uh, that ink, the orange one. And then I wanted another Hiroshi Zuku because the Kompaki was so nice to me. Uh, and I wanted a green. And uh, I just, I went for the CEO row over the... Uh, I don't know what they call the sort of more greeny green, uh, the sort of uh, emerald green that they have. That's also really nice. Um, but I got CO Row, um, and yeah, the rest is history. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know if I, I don't know which one I'm going to use for, uh, up first, the CO Row or the Compaki. Uh, so let's see. I bought this ink. 
after loading Tom Pecky so much. I honestly can't say which I like more Colin Pecky or Theo Rowe. All right. Well, let's do some uh, let's do some old-fashioned splats on this page uh, since I did paintbrush on the other one. Getting my fills getting low though. <laughs> I'll just fill it back up. Uh, am I gonna? Ooh, I don't know if I'm gonna have enough to journal if I do a splat. Let's do one splat and then I'll just grab the paintbrush again. Go big. That's what I say. Bloop. All right, let's grab this again. But yeah, if I do make a more in-depth pen review, I'm curious, what kind of stuff do you guys like to see in pen reviews? In ink reviews, like what is the most helpful thing to you? Um, like, do you need me to sort of like go over like f like a five minute segment about like water resistance? Uh, if there's no water resistance, or you know, what's what sort of thing do you like? I honestly never expected to have this many viewers, so. Um, I am curious what you all like. Right there, Let's zoom out just a little bit. Can't zoom out very far because I am using a Nintendo Switch stand as a tripod. And if I zoom out too far, it does get into the frame. Let's bring back this. Ooh, okay, yeah, you can definitely see the... Uh, it's definitely gotten greener even on, um, on the camera, though you can definitely tell in more in real life that it is firmly on the greener side of teal even though I, I really don't want like calling it a teal. Uh, I can, can you see here? Let's see. Let's try and get the light. If Florida will cooperate. Yeah, definitely right here. You can see that red halo. I once put it in that sort of minty stub nib that I've used a couple times. And it was just like Christmas in a pen. It was very nice. Well, so that will be it for Seven Inks, Seven Days, a regional variant not officially affiliated with hashtag 30 inks, 30 days. Um, I hope you all enjoyed my videos, and I am sincerely thankful for all of you watching. I hope again that uh, all of you are safe, and uh, hopefully tomorrow is better than today. See you in the next video.